Good morning, you guys. Welcome back. I am back into daily life, and that vacation was so relaxing and much needed. I still have not edited the vacation vlog. It's like kind of daunting on me because it is a lot of phone footage because I only vlogged, I put in my camera footage and it was like 10 minutes. So I'm actually gonna be incorporating a ton of Instagram footage and stuff that I took on my phone. Um, so that'll already be up, so check it out um, by the time this video gets up because that's my first priority is to finish editing that. My mom was like, I'm so excited to watch your vacation vlog. I'm like, you were there. <laughs> like, it's gonna take me a while to edit. So I have so much other stuff going on right now that I just haven't, we've been home for almost, almost a week and I have not gotten it edited yet, but that'll be coming. Um, I just got done having a little coffee date, which was really nice. Um, we are gonna be doing an event locally for, um, it's gonna be at a clinic that does um, injections, Botox, they do, um, brow lamination like a whole bunch of like beauty procedures and like cosmetic stuff um so i'm going to be setting up a little pop-up shop there and we're going to have like a local um some other local uh vendors and stuff so we had a little meeting about that and it was really nice i dropped the boys off this morning at the pool with um the babysitter so it's nice that i have a babysitter and like my mom for days like yesterday they were with my mom all day because I had a photo shoot I just have a lot of things work wise that are coming up and um, so I'm really looking forward to fall when both boys are gonna be in school just two days a week but those two days I can schedule things like photo shoots and meetings and like all the things that I can't do without my kids I will be able to schedule on Tuesdays and Thursdays so that I can have like all of that and then still have all the time with them on the rest of the days of the week. So that's what we did this morning. Now I'm going to head over to um, the storefront and I tried to uh, tag a whole bunch of new inventory. We had a live sale last night. So I woke up early to pack local orders. I wanted to get all my locals done because um, I'm going to drop them off with my friend Haley because she has a ton of um, friends at work that buy from me so if I pack up everyone's and just give them all to her she brings them up to work for everybody so I got all those done and then I was like tagging new inventory and I only got like two um, pieces tagged like two separate styles tagged so I'm gonna bring those up um, I have a ton of orders to pack when I get home and just like all the things a huge mess in my office like always after a live sale. So I've got a lot going on um, once I get home, but yeah, I'm gonna go up to the store, pull some things that's sold. I am going, realizing that I'm going up there like a lot more often than once a week to pull things and like bring up new things. So we'll see. Um, this is like my first month in. It hasn't been a full month yet, but things are going um, pretty decent sales wise. It's funny because where I think I'm gonna end the month at is gonna be like um, a typical week online sales wise. Um, so it's a big difference, but I think just having like the presence of a physical storefront and where a place where people can go try things on, a place where people can pick up their orders, like all of that is gonna be just really worth it in the long run, I think. Um, so, but there are still some big, big, big changes <laughs> coming. Um, with that situation, which I might extend this to a like a two-day vlog and I might have more information on that by tomorrow So we'll see but I will get, keep you guys posted on what ends up happening with that so I'm all dressed up in my little Professional outfit today. I'm wearing um, this is our Lily blazer We just have like I think we have three left and then these are our Lily shorts, which are so cute So it's a little linen set, but they're sold separately the blazer's only 42 and the shorts are 32. So it's super affordable little set. And then I just have, this is a bodysuit from Abercrombie. So that's my little outfit. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go run over to the store, then I'm gonna drop off deliveries, and then I'm gonna head home, pick up the boys from the pool, and then probably do some work. I was thinking of taking them to the Dollar Tree, but I think I'm gonna save that for tomorrow um, and let them just kind of pick out a bunch of crafts and like fun things, like summer toys, like things to do because They've been super patient with me as I've been working from home like every day this summer. Um, I really wanna start going to the pool more and stuff. Um, waking up at like, 
this is what I'm trying to do is wake up at like 5 a.m., get work done, and then play in the afternoon, like take them to the pool and stuff because I want them to have a fun summer. Um, and like the whole reason I wanna be a work from home mom is so that I can have the flexibility of taking my kids to places and like still doing fun things while still getting my work done. So anyways, I've been rambling, so I will catch up with you guys in a few minutes. Okay, <laughs> I am home and ready to work. This is the aftermath of last night's live. So we get a little hectic in here, trying clothes on and everything. So yeah, things are crazy. So my first task before I can even like pack orders and start working is to just like fix everything. So I basically I'm gonna go through um, all of this inventory, fold it, steam it, hang it back up, put it away where it needs to go so that I can get to work because this just drives me crazy. So that's my first task of the day. Um, I'm working on website stuff, but this is taking forever. Our internet's like really slow. So I'm trying to update photos on our website, like just like the main pictures because we have so many new arrivals. So I want like the new stuff to be on the like front homepage slideshow. So I'm trying to work on that. I just made a little um, image in Canva. But yeah, everything is so slow. So yeah, I just made a little like collage of the lakeside stuff. And so I'm trying to load that up on here. And then also once that is loaded, I will send out an email with that stuff on there. And I'm also trying to do stuff on my phone. I'm trying to download stuff on my phone too from Canva so I can um, also post on Facebook as well as Instagram, all the new stuff. So everything's just like loading right now. So it's a good time to just step away and start working on all of this. I am just in like comfy clothes now. This is from my boutique. It says on the road again and it's like a super cute just distressed tea by Country Deep and I'm just wearing some like joggers and slippers because I just want to be cozy and get work done. The boys are having quiet time. They had a lot of fun at the pool and yeah, I'm just like, I don't know, <laughs> working. What else? So I'm going to get to work and catch up with you guys in a little bit and start packing orders. I also, since it's Thursday, I always do my buying every Friday, so I'm super excited to buy tomorrow, so I'm gonna try to plan out everything that I'm buying. I have a big budget this week since we had a live sale. Anytime we have a live sale, I always have a lot of success, which means I have a bigger budget for open to buy, so I'm excited to buy new arrivals and lots of pre-fall stuff because it's the end of June, so I'm ready for fall. I don't know about, I don't know about you guys, but like I love like an early seasonal drop. Like I just I get so excited when it's like about to be a new season and you start kind of like seeing the stuff and you're like, oh, it's gonna be a new season soon. So I love that kind of stuff. So that's what I get to work on later, but right now it's cleaning time. Oh my gosh, I feel so much better, so much more accomplished. Um yeah, I think I'm gonna take a little break now from work. What I typically do is do some work, then do some family stuff or um, housework. So I'm gonna go check on the kids. They probably are done with their quiet time and I'm gonna probably fold a little bit of laundry for a little bit, um, but I kind of pulled some things that I know sell the other, n selled, <laughs> oh my gosh, sold the other night as I was putting things away so I wouldn't have to re-grab them so I made a little pile there um and then I don't even know this is like a hodge oh the, I guess this is what we were had on our sale last night but um I'm not fully done but everything is at least tidy now you guys this is such a cute little set that we got in it's like a little like um bandeau top that ties in the front with some high-waisted pants and it's so cute. I set this one aside right here because I think I'm going to keep one for myself and wear it um, for 4th of July weekend. So that's super cute, but um, everything is pretty much all clean now. We had our Trulies last night while we did our live and in here, the bathroom is totally part of my studio now. Oh, I hear the kids. Um, is stuff that I'm planning on taking to the store. So I have to tag all this stuff and everything, but I'm not in a rush Really the only thing I try to rush is like time-sensitive stuff like new arrivals and then of course orders so 
I'm gonna take a little break, check on the kids, and hang out. Good morning, you guys. It's the next day. Um, we just relaxed the rest of the night. I was looking at inventory and everything. Did my buying this morning. I did not do any more laundry. I feel like that TikTok where they're like, and her plan was, and then it says like all the things she ended up not doing. That's how I feel. Um, because I didn't fold any laundry. I didn't even pack any orders last night. I kind of just like was exhausted. Um, so I woke up early this morning, I woke up at five, did our finances, um, did my buying, and then I spent about an hour packing orders downstairs, which I still have a lot to do um, to pack orders, but I got some done. I got like six of them done. So I'm gonna go to the post office today and bring those. Um, I did get dressed for the gym. I only went on Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday and Thursday I didn't go because I was busy working. So I'm gonna go to the gym today even though I do not feel like it at all. Um, but I have a local, well, not really a local delivery. I just have a friend of mine that ordered from me who goes to the gym. So that's like my motivation to bring her package. Um, so like I have to go so I can bring her package. And then also I promised the boys I would take them to the Dollar Tree. So we're gonna do that today after the gym. So. That's the plan, and I will take you guys along with our day. We just got to the dollar. They don't have cake pops at the dollar store. <laughs> You're thinking of Target. Um, so we're gonna go in there. We're not going to Target. We're gonna go in there and get some crafts. And then also, I realized we've been so low on snacks. I haven't shopped at Sam's Club in like a couple of months. So I've been going to Aldi's. And so we've been running out of snacks really fast and we're not getting groceries until Monday. Today's Friday. So I'm gonna, we're gonna go through their snacks department in the Dollar Tree too because they have a lot of good snacks in there and I'll, I will load up on some snacks for the house and some crafts to do and then I think I'm gonna take them over to Wendy's afterwards and get them some food. I'll probably get food for me and David too but it's kind of, you know, just a little treat day. It's Friday so let's go do it. I'm so excited to see what we pick out. Okay, we just got home. Look at this fancy Wendy's bag we caught. I got lunch for everybody david too he's in his office he's um now he's like going back and forth so he's here one week and then in the office the next week so it's nice i love it when he's home Mom. um what honey oh i'll get your Mom. drinks he got what mom yeah um this is our dollar tree that's that's Cruz. I'll open yours. Mm -hmm. So we got a ton of craft no, this stuff. Is mine. No, yours is bigger. I'll bring yours over. He's literally already grown out of the kids' meal because he eats ten. Well, six to ten. McDonald's has six nuggets, but Wendy's does not. So I have to get him like an actual adult meal. I feel like now because he eats so many chicken nuggets that he grew out of the kids' meal. So anyways, I got these bins. So I'm gonna pull everything out and like organize it all um, in the craft drawer and paint and all kinds of stuff. So I'll show you guys once it's all pretty and organized. And then I also just, so yeah, we just got like a whole bunch. This was nice. I almost took them to Michael's and I'm like, this is way cheaper and better because like the markers dry out and all that. So this is a nice way to just like have it more affordable. Um, and then I grabbed snacks too. So we got like some random snack items while we were in there just because like I said, we're really low on snacks right now. So I gotta put all that away. But first we're gonna eat. Let me show you the craft drawer right now. It's pretty bad. <laughs> so this is what it looks like right now. So I'm going to pull everything out and reorganize it and make it nice. And I also just changed to into comfy clothes. These are the same shorts I wore to the gym, but I don't care, whatever. <laughs> I just wanna keep them on. These are our black high rise biker shorts from my store. And then this top, it's newer, um, but it's getting close to being sold out. It's a really nice like sweater top. I have it in blue and tan. And I wore the blue one on vacation. This is the tan one, my first time wearing it. It's just so comfortable, and but it's also like super cute to just lounge around and but I mean obviously I would totally wear this out and about too but 
Yes, yeah, so that's my little outfit because I'm just going to hang out at home. I have a whole list I made of all the things I want to get done today. It's Friday, so we'll stay up late. Um, hopefully, I'll hear some updates too on my store. If I do, I will share. So that's the plan for today. Okay, this gives me all the satisfaction. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this part too. But I just organized everything. So I've got, um, I got two of these little paint kits. And then the rest of this is just paper, um, crayons. These are all coloring books in here. Colored pencils. How cute is this little pencil sharpener? This is all Dollar Tree. I have paint on my fingers because they were painting already. Um, this is all paint stuff. Most of this stuff is old, um, but it's still in good condition. I threw out anything that was like dried up. Um, and then I got them a couple painting things and then some new paints. And then this is like um, random stuff, stamps, Play-Doh. They wanted these birdhouses to paint. Googly eyes, pom-poms, and lots of stickers in there. And then markers, glue, scissors, and paintbrushes. So now I just need to put it all away. So I'll show you guys what that'll look like. Here, babe. Let's put it all away first, okay? Okay, here's how the drawer looks now. So satisfying, and now we have so many crafts and things for them to do right here in the kitchen. Closes up perfectly. Okay, so a very exciting package just came in. This is my new neon sign. So I ordered it from the same guy that made my first one. He's on Etsy. Um, if you guys are interested, send me a message and I'll give him um, give you his info because I actually ordered this second one just straight through him like from his instagram um so this one is actually bigger if you guys remember the one down in my office this is like actually double the size um so this is for the store i'm gonna hang it on the wall in the store and i'm so excited it looks so good so these two pieces are separate so i can put it like kind of slightly underneath or i can just put them next to each other i'll see i'll play around with it um and then i guess i'll just put uh, nails in right where these holes are. So yeah, I'm so excited. It's super, super affordable too compared to um, neon signs. Like most neon signs are um, upwards of like $600, especially for like something this large. Um, but this person's super affordable. It just takes like, took like three weeks to ship because he lives in Ukraine. So I'm so excited. It's going to just like totally pull the whole space together. Okay, also, since I'm opening packages, I got a Nespresso order. I haven't ordered Nespresso in a few months because I haven't needed it. So I usually just order like every like three or four months and I kind of stock up. But I got um, the Tropical Coconut flavor. So I'm excited for that one. I've tried, my friend let me try one of hers. So I've tried it before. Caramel Cookie, that's my favorite. Then I got Half Caffeinated and then I also got um decaf is this one decaf? yeah in the decaf because i know i was saying ha i was having a lot of anxiety issues before we left for vacation and i think caffeine has a lot to do with that so i actually have been totally healed praise the lord since i've been home and since we were on vacation i think i just needed that break um because i haven't had any issues with anxiety but when i was i went ahead and ordered these so that I can still, because sometimes I still like to have my coffee in the morning, but like then I feel like an hour or so later I'll have like breathing issues because if I'm like very anxious that day. So got the decaf ones, hazelnut, and then this one I've never tried either, chocolate fudge. So that sounds good. So I got those and then I got in our Plexus order, two bags of active, which is like the energy drink balance i swear by this you guys this is like basically like block um but we switched to balance now and i use this daily i actually just used it before i had wendy's um but it helps block carbs and sugars and it helps let's see it says it helps delay the digestion of carbs and sugars and it maintains your blood sugar levels and supports weight management so i love this stuff i keep one in my car, one in David's car, one in our kitchen, and one in our bathroom because it's just that good. You can take them up to three times a day. So I just usually take it before like a heavy meal um, or at the end of the night if I feel like I ate really bad that day, I'll take one. Um, these are the probiotics I use and then the multivitamin. So 
just restocked my supplements I order every month from Plexus. So I, I think I'm going to go do some work on my computer in bed because my back is aching. Um, I've been up since five, worked out outside, did a lot of like squats and things like overhead stuff or I just feel like my back hurts. Honestly, my back hurts me every day. I don't know if I need to either go to a chiropractor or try to do the surgery I've been wanting to do, the abdominal repair surgery, tummy tuck, but something. <laughs> one day, one day I'll feel better again it's just every single day especially around this time it's like three o'clock my back is always like dead so i'm gonna go lay in bed probably with a heating pad and do work on my computer and i still have to pack some orders and stuff but it's friday now so i'm not like super rushed because it's not like um i don't know the weekend so anyways that's what i'm gonna do and keep you guys posted on the rest of the day you guys i finished editing my vlog finally i'm putting the last touches just the little end screen on here i think this is just a big weight off my shoulders <laughs> because um you'll see you've probably already seen this vlog by now if you watch my videos um but i took a lot of footage on my phone on instagram like i was instagramming on stories like the whole like first first day and then second day and third day and so by the time i was like ready to finally pick up my actual camera and vlog i was like tired it was our last day and so i like didn't get a whole lot of like vacation footage and so i was trying to incorporate a lot of um instagram stories to try to make it all flow and like look like we had a lot i don't know it's 27 minutes and yeah but i also understand that like not everybody wants to just sit and watch some someone's like someone else's vacation like that's also kind of boring so i try to like do like this tour i did a tour of where we stayed and then i just kind of showed clips and stuff throughout because it's like you don't really care about someone else's like vacation <laughs> except for like where they ate or like what the resort looked like type stuff so anyways yay i'm done i worked from bed because that's what we do here so anyways oh golly these kids my mom just ordered this shirt and actually i just sold another blue one it's such a cute shirt um now i'm ready to get out of bed it's like five o'clock um the boys want to paint again and i told them to wait until i was done editing and then i would help them paint so we're gonna go do that and i will probably pour myself a glass of wine um, pack some orders. Maybe I will end the vlog here too. I know I said I was going to talk about some store update situation, um, but it's still not finalized, so I'm not going to talk about it. I promise you I will eventually. As soon as things are finalized, I'm going to tell you guys what's going on with it. It's nothing crazy. It's not like I'm... It's not anything crazy. It's just some changes are happening and... Um, I'm definitely probably, I think I said this already, I'm either moving or I'm getting a second location. So that's basically the, that's the T. But um, I'm not going to say the actual details yet until everything's finalized. So, anywho, thank you guys so much for watching, for all of your support. I love that you guys still enjoy these youtube videos you know i know i'm only doing them once a week if that but i know there's a lot of you out there that still enjoy watching them um so i really want to keep them going for you guys and also thank you so much for all of you who have kind of started to support me on my boutique journey even if you're not buying from me you know a lot of you guys just support me like encouraging words and stuff and like watching our live videos like i just it's like a whole nother level to me of like I mean it's my dream job but also it's like a whole nother level of just like getting to know like my internet friends and stuff because like now that a lot of you guys are shopping with me and like getting on our lives I'm like hey girl like I know you guys by name and like I know your size I know what you like I know what state you live in like it's kind of creepy but I just like I feel like it's just such a fun like connection now having like this store and just like all of the relationships that I've made through it and it's just so fun so anyways I will see you guys in my next video probably next week or so so I will talk to you guys later bye I belong, I belong to you.
I belong, I belong to you.